Alright. I need to figure out who the heck I'm using for this. Um, also, hello. How are we all? I hope we're doing good. There's the potential that I use Garganackle, but that seems like a bad idea. I feel like the intended way is to use an electric type, because then you're kind of forcing its less strong move. Also, have I only just noticed that whenever the airplane advert comes up here, there's just a Rayquaza flying alongside it? I must admit, I haven't paid much attention to them. You were mid-passing out when you remembered we might still be doing this. Well, I'm glad you didn't completely passing out. Even though the passing out may have been better for your health. So I guess I'm not. I'm glad you're here. If you need to sleep, I do not begrudge you that choice. Yeah, there's just a Rayquaza there. And a Dragon. And a... I don't know, Goldeen? Anyway... Can I interest you in a game of kicking chicken? Uh, well, it depends on whether I'm going to use any kicking moves. Because I'm sure shit not taking little gal. Uh, Alright. From my vague googling on this one, because I didn't necessarily want this to take too long, I did see that there's a strat for... Um, uh, what is it? Uh, belly Bolt. Is apparently pretty good. Because you acid spray and then you just parabolic charge until it dies. Or there's also chilling water that you can use. Something. Something like that. Anyway. Alternatively, I could galvanize explosion. And do a small amount of damage. <sighs> Um, like bringing in Palmer is maybe not the worst call either. I don't know. I don't know. Um, I don't think Chin Chow would do particularly well with 139 defense. All the bulk is in HP and it uh, doesn't have that much recovery, unfortunately. It's not like it's going to use an electric move on me. Uh, yeah. I mean, bringing in someone that can grassy terrain to lower the power of the earthquake would be something. It's a pity that grass is not good against fire or flying. So, if there's an electric type that learns grassy terrain... That could be a thing that happens. Yeah. Um, hmm. Like, my other option is use a killer watchful. Uh, I don't know what other moves I can learn with a killer watchful. Let's just move Buffet to the friend's box. Uh, Alright. What moves can you use? So, we got Charge Beam, no. Electric Ball, probably not. Because I'm assuming this thing's going to have Speed Boost and will move first. Charge, probably not useful. Electro Web? Uh, I don't think that'll do enough. Just one shot it. I mean, if it goes long enough, we'll build up a one shot, but. Oh, yeah, that physical defense is not going to be a good plan. Uh, what's the other one? That's not what I wanted. Uh, the other one would have been. Uh, Electros. So let's give Electros a look. Yeah, you got sturdy. That doesn't help. Like, I could Magnet Rise, but I would die to Earthquake before I got to use Magnet Rise. 
If I did manage to use Magnet Rise, I'd die to a fire move, but... Yeah, no. Um... I'm sure I've got one somewhere. Blueberry. Uh, no. Galvantula, you died of fire. Why is fire and flying such a good combo? Anyway. Yeah, motor drive, it's the same thing. Um. I mean, I mean, we don't want it to use Sunny Day, but if it uses it, I need to see what else you got. Uh, so Raging Bolt, you got the Protosynthesis proto -synthesis thing, you're definitely a special attacker. So that's what's getting boosted. Uh, we can use electric terrain. Which should be something. Uh, we got Sunny Day, because I feel like most of the Paradox Mon have Sunny Day. Gotta remember what your moves do. Um, okay, right. Electric type Sucker Punch. Cool. So that'll be able to hit. Rising voltage, double power if the target's on electric terrain. Okay. Uh, but it's going to be a flying type, so it's not going to be on electric terrain, is it? Hmm. That's annoying, because that would have been real good. Alright, uh, what do you get by a TM? Charge beam. We're looking for more electric moves. I mean, there's thunder. Um, yeah, classic T bolt. Yeah, just lower special attack. It's not worth it. Um, I'm gonna be slower than it. Also, change shit. Yeah, no. Just because it's a flying type doesn't mean it's not affected by terrain. I mean, I'm pretty sure it does mean that. Alright. I'm pretty sure flying types just aren't affected by terrain. Let me look up Bulbapedia. Uh, Uh, let's see. Okay, affects all Pokemon on the ground. Uh, hmm. Setting terrains? No, I just want to know what grounded means. Um, hmm. It's flying type or levitate like always. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's how it's supposed to work. So place can touch the ground. Okay, so here's the problem. You're trying to apply actual logic to a Pokemon game. Um, yeah, I need to figure out... Okay, on the ground, let's see. Uh, okay, a Pokemon is ungrounded if any of the following apply and there's no effect that makes it grounded. It has the flying type, Terra counts, it has the ability levitate, it's holding an air balloon, or it's under Magnet Rise or Telekinesis. So it has the flying type, therefore it is not grounded. 
I don't know if SmackDown affects uh, Terror Raidmon, but that is something to try. Because, yeah, I think once it's been smacked down, it's smacked down forever? Uh, grounds the target. Yeah, ground it until they switch out, and they don't switch out. So, uh, I guess let's le read through Smackdown to see if it works on Terror Raid things. Because I'm not sure if... Eh? I have no idea what point you're trying to make with this. Most flying types are in the air. Yeah. Um... Trivia. No. Alright. Well, I'll try bringing. Well. Excuse me. Uh, I don't know if we. I'm pretty sure I can't learn Smack. Actually, can I learn SmackDown? I don't know if I have the TM for SmackDown at the moment. Or if it's a TM I can learn. Um. Made. We got a rock. Okay, I have Smackdown. I cannot learn it with Raging Bolt. It's an interesting thought. If someone's willing to try it out, then cool. You're bringing Darkspawn? Can a Rain Dance turn one if nobody has objections? And if you're going to be Rain Dancing, I might try bringing... Uh, no, I'll just use Rising Voltage. It's going to be 140. If we can get Smackdown happening. Um, like, I don't want to bring a Rock type. It seems like a bad idea. But like a Rock... Uh, like a mini ore, I guess. Rock flying type, or something. Like if the first turn is all set up, like I use electric terrain with raging bolt, or something. Uh, if I do that, do I want? probably want a uh, shell bell, don't I? What well, booster energy? Yeah, booster energy, probably. Um, right, I forgot I grabbed that. Yeah, I didn't have a special rain extender. Alright, that's cool. Um... Well, actually, while I'm in there. XP candy, go! Oh, you learn Zap Cannon. That's very interesting. Um, no. Body Press, also no. Thunder, well, if you're just going to learn it, that's cool too. No, unlearn Dragon Hammer. I do want to get electric terrain. Cool. Uh, at, uh, raging ball. Uh, nope, I need to change your moves. I think you get terrain by level up. Calm mind ain't gonna do much. Terrain can swap for 
Man, the priority could be nice. Um, yeah, that's 110. Just go full electric, I guess. Yeah, fuck it. Does that cannon go to 100 in rain? I don't know. Zap cannon. Because if it does, then cool. Uh, yeah, thunder does. Zap cannon. Uh, Parallels every time it hits. No, I'm not seeing anything about it being 100 accuracy in the rain. Rain does not 100% all electric. It is only thunder and hurricane that it makes 100 accuracy. I suppose it would have been just easier for me to search rain instead of zap cannon. Oh well. Um, yeah, more special attack, more defense, I guess. Time to use some goddamn mochi. Not using mochi just yet. Uh, HP times two five. Why am I doing two fifty two health? Great question. Moving on. Uh, all right, and it's calcium. Wow, well, dang, calcium for days. Genius feather. Times two. Uh, I guess just no. some defense for the last four. Good. Math has gone correctly. Right. Rain and Zap Cannon did 100% in Gen 3. Huh. I know Zap Cannon is 100% accuracy in the lab in Fire Red Leaf Green because it's just weird like that. Um. I might want to use a mint for up special attack minus attack. Just while I'm here. Mint, 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 mint. Uh, what are we? We're modest? We're modest. Okay. So I guess I'll also connect to Darnet. You had a Kyoga with Zap Cannon. Well, fair enough. I'm going to look up rain then. See if that's still the case. Uh, okay. Mm. Effects in battle. Uh... In battle allows Thunder, Hurricane, Bleak Wind Storm, Wild Bolt Storm, and Sandseer Storm to bypass accuracy check. So it's not even 100% accuracy, it's just bypasses the check completely. It's not mentioning Zap Cannon. Uh, not seeing it ever do anything about Zap Cannon ever. I think you just got lucky, my dude. <laughs> Rain buffs Blaziken? Uh... Que question mark? How? Does it have Hurricane as its flying move? Does the Terra Blaze can have Hurricane? I don't know. Let me have a look. Yeah, Brave Bird is a physical attacker. That's what I would have thought. Uh, yeah, Blaze Kick, Brave Bird, Earthquake, Low Kick. Oh yeah, I need to I put Electric Terrain on. Uh, yes, good. 
Um, do we have a... well... Our Skidian Toon joining us for such raids as these. Too tall for this screen. Well, this is a good check for the Protosynthesis. Yep, it does do special attack. Good. Uh, okay, while I'm here. Okay, it does not use... Uh... Brain, help me out here. It does not use Sunny Day at any time. So that's good to know. Is anyone willing to bring... Is anyone willing to bring something with Smackdown? to test theories. Okay, it does Swords Dance pretty early into the fight. So I'm hoping... I guess we're hoping for... Uh, well, I don't know what the Darkspin's gonna do, but hopefully there's some attack down procs on Play Rough? I don't know why we're going through all this effort when you have a Maridon. I mean, fair enough. I don't have a Maridon, so I don't think of these things. Well, if, you're, if you've got Maridon, then I don't need to do electric terrain things, and I can just go straight into other stuff. Okay, well, Mudslap, Mudslap isn't gonna do anything, because it's a flying type, so all you've got is Lick. Charm for the first couple of things, uh, which which will be helpful. But lick for paralysis. Didn't know it was flying when you do that. Is the thing? Ah, fair enough. Fair enough. Um, yeah, without knowing what Darkspun has, I'd suggest probably play rough. Yes, that's what we're saying. That's why we need Smackdown, so that it can be grounded if that works. Which is why we had the whole discussion about does it fly, being a flying type. And yes, it does, so we need Smackdown. I feel like I'm getting too annoyed about this. I will calm down. I will calm down. Yeah, but our electric attacks are still boosted by terrain. So we like we can still get increased electric damage with terrain. Also, I think Skitty's saying, hey, why don't we just debuff its special defense and Skitty can one-shot it with Electro Drift? Is my thought process there, but I do want to at least try it with Raging Bolt, just to see how it goes. Ninety ninety chance to lower attack, I think, for Play Rough. Well, you want me to attack? Mud Slap's an attack. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's not happening. Fair enough. Fair enough. Do you want to just fight it like this? I can throw on Parabolic Charge to keep myself healed. Oh, to have Parabolic Charge. What a luxury. See, I only play with bad electric types. <laughs> um, yeah. Yeah, that's probably... It's probably better that some of us actually survive the fight. Just in general. 
Cat. Anyway. So yeah, GDQ over for another. Well, a GDQ is over for another year, and my YouTube watch later list is sad. I had gotten it to zero over the Christmas break. Helping hand fickle. I'd gotten it to zero over the Christmas break. And I was happy. And then like less than two weeks after the Christmas break is over, haha, <laughs> you pack up to 70. 70 things that are like at least 20 minutes long, generally. <sighs> so now I'm curious whether Darkspin can learn Smackdown. Uh Smackdown move. Watch the later list has several hundred videos because you use as a secret favorites playlist for super favorites. Yeah. See, I usually forget to favorite things. So it's only the things that I really like and oops, I remembered there was a favorites list that get in the favorites list. Yeah. Uh, learn set by, I guess, TM. Let's check level up first. Uh, okay. Not by level up. TM. Uh, no, Darkspin cannot load it. Damn. Oh well, worth a shot. Uh, strong recommend for the Super Mario Sunshine run. Okay. Uh, I was already going to watch the Crystal Rando run, because, yeah, it's Pokemon content. Uh, also, Shen, good. Enjoy Shen. I don't know if I had the Sunshine run on my list, but I'll give that one a look. What was the one that was on yesterday? It was um, like a hamster restaurant one. That was interesting. Chrism was the other one, right? 360 Chrism. This one was so funny. I have seen none of it. That one was on while I was either at work or asleep, which was like the majority of the time the AGDQ was on, and I'm sad about that, because I like watching the uh, AGDQ. Huh. So yeah, the amount of runs that I've actually seen so far, kinda low. First one was great, but you're also thinking of the Diamond Run, actually. Oh. I mean, yeah, the Pokemon runs are usually pretty fun. Uh, let me know when you guys are ready, by the way. Oh, hey, that's got a big mark. Neat. Well, not a big mark. It just big. Donation barrage was just insane. Damn. Ready? Alright. Uh, let's see how this do. So, code's going up. Make sure you're online and all that jazz. Yeah, it, it's, it's just always a fun time. The, uh, the last run went uh, a good chunk over the estimate because of uh, routing issues. Not routing issues, but like a problem occurred midway through the run that had on-the-fly routing. Real interesting to watch it like actually happen and like try to figure it out and all that. But it gave people time to hit the incentive to do the or the final what was it? Uh threshold incentive? That's the wrong word. But anyway. Whenever a marathon comes up, you make plans with life to pick out a bunch of runs to watch together. It's a good call. It's a good call. Uh what is it? Frost Fatals early March. And then SGDQ just End of June, start of July. Those will be fun. Oh yeah, I sh uh, I'm assuming Toon is not joining in on this. Uh, and we'll see how we do with just three. So let's see how we do with just three. I don't know why that communicating thing is still spinning, but... Alright. Give it a shot. If Toon uh, then says that... It, I mean... 
it seems like Toon is busy doing Power World things. If you fail three, you'll hop it made to lose strength right now. Right, cool. It's Chimkin. The amazing dancing Chimkin. So tall. Boost her energy goes burr. Okay, since this goes burr. Special attack goes burr. Uh, oh, let's see. I'm gonna thunder clap. Get clapped. Alright, you know what? Not bad. How much do I take from Earthquake? Also, not bad. Ah, son of a bitch. We had to get our believer, didn't we? That's not gonna help. Heck. Big yikes. Well, there goes debuffs, here comes an overheat. On specifically that guy. Why did it only hit that one? Where did the time go? How long do you think this takes, game? There we go. Um, I guess I'll reset electric terrain. Ouch. I guess I'm heavy and it decided that was a better move. Oh, because it wasn't... Okay, that makes sense. Also, I'm definitely going to die now. Um, oh, son of a bitch, I just brought that back. Didn't think it would be back yet. Well, I suppose it took two hours, so... Uh, thunder. And dead because of the sword stance. Alright. I believe it did not help us out on that one. Definitely did not help us out on that one. Oh my god, I believe it. Fuck it, we thunder? Do I live one? Well, I live one. That did not enough damage. It even has Seed Sower. Does that have. Yeah, that's why it's our believer. That's why it's the problem, because we're not getting the boosted anything. I don't realize I would be this weak to low kick. It'd be nice if we could, like, get a choice of three like, allies to help us out. Great. I'm at least going to get some damage into these thunderclaps. Yeah. Alright, well, that uh, sucked. That sucked a lot. We'll give it one more shot, but then I'll just uh, bring in the normal lads. Yeah. Yeah, I want to give that a shot without it bringing up grassy terrain every single goddamn turn. Um. Yeah, definitely. Because it only uses swords dance. Once? Yeah, it uses Swords Dance once and Bulk Up once, based on time remaining. Uh, well, the Shield Up is when it got to 80% HP. 
Stats and status reset is at 70% HP. So if we can like stall for time until it hits uh no, it gets to shield at 80%, so it's not gonna work. Um Oh yeah, it was not uh being a team player. Uh, let's give that another shot, codes on the screen. Um Yeah, it'll also use Rock Slide at 50% remaining. Uh, can Belly Bolt get Chilling Water? I wouldn't think so. Like, Belly Bolt is the suggested from what I've seen. Uh, let's see. Oh, Lantern gets it. You can acid spray, but you need the berry to stop the earthquake. Okay. Uh, yeah, Belly Bolt gets chilling water. shot. Because I think the general idea is belly bolt, turn one, acid spray, and then just keep parabolic charging. Because it's gonna keep hitting you. Oh, Belly Bolt's only for the one turn setup. Okay. I see. I see. Because it would get Earthquake to death? Alright. Alright. That makes sense. Yeah, we got a God of War. Alright, that's better. Now it's just starting with Loki. Which is interesting. Just gonna keep doing this. Let's try and take it to. Okay, there's swords. So now we got the charm hammer. So it's not going to use sword stance again. I'm going to wait until it overheats to Tarasquise. There it goes. There's no burn. Do I wait until I come back? Uh, we don't have rain yet. There's the quake. Okay, that's really not doing much, which is good. Its attack debuffs are gone. Which means 
I'm presumably going to die, so let's just get a hit in before I go. Okay. Takes me out. Alright, now I terrestrialize when I come back. Rising voltage for now. It's still bulked up, but hopefully we can clear out shield fast. It's gonna do big and bang bench. Hopefully the life do keeps me alive a little bit. I did okay. I think I need to risk a thunder though. It's gonna suck if this fails. Alright, I've got another attack in me. And thunder's failed. God damn it. Ah. 70% moves, man. 70% moves. Alright. Alright, well now I'm helping hand, so I have to do it. That's how that works, right? Where did my... Did my health move? I don't think it did. Alright. Cool. That shield's going away. Oh, good. Paralysis. Love that proc. That's why I wanted to be using Thunder. There's the rock slide. That was a crit. Shield is gone. Good. Still no rain. Fuck it, we ball. I'm faster now because the paralysis. Ha ha! You fool! Uh, do, do it again. Ah, now we have the rain. Ah, and we get the paraproc. I really spent the last three turns cheering to stay alive. Terrain's gone, but brave bird, eh? All right, well, resisted. Yeah, now we can get the charm back in there. Clap them cheeks. You don't get to move. Alright. Just a little preoccupied with not dying. I don't begrudge you that at all. And hey, it worked. That, hit, that helping hand was why we, were, why we broke the shield. Yeah. No, I, I get it. I get it. I was just annoyed at accuracy being accuracy. Uh, it's got to be the fastball, right? It's got to be the fastball. Look at this chicken and tell me it's not in a fastball. I need more weird Pokeballs. So I want to get more weird Pokeballs and we need to do more uh, BQs at some point. Sport Ball? Yeah, Sport Ball's nice. It fits. It definitely fits. Yay, patch. Ooh, okay, nice. Huzzah! We have acquired the Chimkin. The Chimkin is real. I still want to know whether Smackdown would have worked. Chimkin. Yeah, Chimkin. Blaze kick, break bird, earthquake, low kick. Don't think a boss that only took two tries ever made us this angry. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's a bit weird. 
Uh, Alright. Go with the spoils of war. I mean, the ball fits. Alright. Um. You have Smackdown? You do not. I want to teach you Smackdown. Does anyone mind if we, like, just go into one to see if Smackdown would have connected? I just kind of want to know. Wait, I'm just gonna remember Smackdown on you. Okay, you're only a TM. Um, surely I've got a rock type in here. Uh, right, no, I know who it will work on. Meatball. Meatball can learn Smackdown, I'm sure. Uh, da, da, da. Yeah, there we are, Smackdown. Uh, swap that for double ed. Uh, swap it for stone edge. Just for learning. I suppose I can just use it on a raid Pokemon. It doesn't have to be specifically a flying type. Uh, where's the nearest raid? There it is. Yeah, this is just to see whether or not it works. Sure. I still don't think it would have been a good call, but it would be fun. Uh, change Pokemon. Why did I... Yeah. Let's see if this works. Because, yeah, my thinking was that it doesn't work if you target a raid mon the same way you can't do, like, um... Uh, what is it? It's like trick like you can't do item switching moves i think some of the weight ones don't work well i guess this isn't really a weight one so maybe it's fine. i don't know there's just enough weirdness around it that it might work or it might not if it does it would have helped specifically rising voltage it would have made rising voltage by far the best move. Not by far. By 30 and accuracy, the best move. Uh, Smackdown. Okay, it would have worked. This thing's almost dead. This sure was a three star. Maybe it wouldn't have worked if... Shields? Were... No, it's a damaging move with a secondary effect it would have been fine like I don't think knockoff works against raid Pokemon anyway we run and we explode oh the Garnapar went first rude wait can you not explode in a raid battle okay we're doing second science hang on no, I don't need you um, but I wanted fuck it we boom I must know now can I go boom I guess they wouldn't want you to do that to like fuck over other people in raids but It's fun. <laughs> Not the fucking other people over, the exploding. Alright, you there. Uh, four star raid, sure. Can I explode? I would like to explode. Because, like... It should work. Like a, sh a Luxio would not have had damp, so that ain't it. Okay. 
can I explode? I cannot explode! Huh. Well, today I learned. Neat! Um... I'll hit it with a supercell. Like, I'm in the fight now, I might as well just go ham. I did a lot more than the previous... Oh, because it's using it against everyone else as well. That makes more sense. Anyway, we do this more. Hope not to miss. Oh, nice crit. Will this kill me? No, it must have reset at some point. It does have shields. Burned, idiot. Fuck it, I'll galvanize another way. I wonder if this still gets the type boosting if I'm terrestrializing to a different type. Interesting. I don't know. Yep, no, it still does the thing. God, big. But man, Terra Electric Galvanize Explosion? That's just so much damage. I don't even think that. Alright, well, um, thanks for joining me on another episode of Science with Sea Dude. Uh, turns out. We can't explode, but we can throw rocks. Good stuff. Yeah. Alright. Um. Oh, hey, love top. Neat. Yeah, I don't think there's really anything else I specifically want to do today. Um, the only thing I really felt the need to do was the uh, the raid. Let's get Raging Bolton battle ready. It's not quite friends status, but bring Buffet back in. Yeah. Yeah. Um, that went well enough, I guess. We succeeded as soon as we didn't have the thing that removed electric terrain. So, that's good. That's good. Um, yeah, anyway. Uh, that'll do it for me for today. I should be back next week. Um, unsure whether I'll keep going with Power World or if I'll just kind of switch straight back to Dragon Quest Treasures. Uh, I don't think I've got anything on next weekend. Uh, oh, although I do have Friday off because it's a public holiday, so uh, potentially three streams this weekend. See how we go. Depends on whether I'm doing anything for Australia Day. Um, so yeah, whether it's Pal World, whether it's Dragon Quest Treasures, not sure at the moment. There has been a lot of like talk on the internet about Pal World being very uh, AI generated kind of stuff. So I'm kind of debating whether I keep going with it. It's still a fun game, but I don't know, I'll see how things shake out this week. But. So far, I'm thinking, yeah, I'll keep playing it. But we'll see how we go. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. I will see you guys later for more things. Whenever they do another raid event, which... Have they just been doing it every... Like, as soon as one ends, the next one begins. So maybe there'll be another thing of this next week. Who can say? Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this. I'll see you guys later.
Bye bye. Thank <laughs> you.